All right, now do, do something. Okay. I really, there's something very like disturbing about this spider-like thing banging on its enclosure, begging to be free to do who knows why? Probably bad things because it's a spider. Hey guys, welcome back to Monster Monday. Last Monster Monday, I didn't play this game, but I did play My Singing Monsters Dawn of Fire. What I will say about that is it does not hold a candle to this game. No pun intended, you know, because ca candles are on fire. Dawn of Fire is a cool game, guys, and I did tell you, you know, if you gave me 10,000 likes on the video, I would at some point do more Dawn of Fire, and uh, you definitely hit that like goal, which is great. If you missed the video, you can uh, watch it with the link down below. There's probably a link down below. <laughs> and now, I will show you how much money I have made on this island, okay? Because I'm at that point where, you know, I really wish I had millions of dollars. <laughs> What box? 470k. And I logged in a day ago. And obviously if you make these guys happier, that helps. He's not as happy as he could be because poor Thrawn over here. He, uh, he likes some things that I can't get. Well, he likes this, um... Amber thing, but 25 million dollars, Wallbox? Are you kidding me, dude? And the other thing he likes, uh, I can't remember. Uh, you have the experiment to find out. Uh, it's something else that I believe is pretty expensive. Now, Ferg down here, $134,000, pretty good. Every single day, he'll give you this if you actually log in. I don't know what's going on here. There's something wrong with my screen. You can still kind of click, okay? 288 gold per minute. Uh, because he's 100% happy. So people have been saying to me, Matt, you should make an Entbrat farm so you can get lots of money. Guess what I did? I started making an Entbrat farm. Trying to save up some money here. <laughs> and the Wubox and the uh, and the Guest and the Entbrat definitely help a lot. That's like almost a million dollars between them, sort of. My math is wrong on that one. It's probably closer to like 800K. You get the idea. Also collected that one diamond. Thank you for using my referral code, guys, because uh, that's the main way that I've been getting diamonds, because I don't have these mines set up yet. One thing at a time, okay? Don't overwhelm me. I get overwhelmed really easily. Wow, Matt, that's a lot of imprints. How much we got here? 89, 89, 89, 89, 44, and 11. Now, you might be wondering, Matt, why did you mute everything on the island except for this guy right here? Because he's friends with the Ent Brats, okay? Don't you know? Don't you know how that works? I got all my my Ent Brats, including good old Bertilda over here. They're 100% happy. Why? Because they got their old friend Mammoth and the other things, including question mark. I don't know why it doesn't just show me what it is, because I know what it is, okay? Because I got all the things. But whatever, you do you. This one's literally called La. <laughs> That's such a good name, it really describes how you go, La! Now these will also make me, I guess, 89, something like that. But I need more, obviously. Now you guys, even though, you know, I didn't tell you that I even had this going on, you did swoop on in and uh, light my torches. So you guys are champs, thank you. I actually, well, what's this? Another ant brat. Matt Shea actually waited until something hatched instead of just paying diamonds for it. This is the craziest day of my life. I can't afford to do this very much, guys. I'm running out of food. But I got $1.8 million now. See, this is the good stuff. Okay, well, you guys are you're doing fantastic. I'm just gonna do a quick spin in my golden castle thing over here. Why is it golden? I don't know. I just upgraded it and it turned to gold. Wow, 21K, actually a decent amount of the stuff. Thank you. You guys are done. They, they did their thing. They're happy now. I gotta get one more, get it to level 10, and we'll just we'll just have the eight for now. I think that'll be good. I don't have any diamonds left. I was actually thinking about making, uh, you know, buying some more diamonds today, um, and then you know, using them to get more ant brats. Cause I have a lot of space on this island thanks to that castle. Just a tip you might not know: your chances to breed monsters is also affected by your monsters' level. Make sure to level them up. So you use less diamonds. I do know that. That is a thing somebody told me and I've been keeping it in mind and I try and get them up when I can, but I just haven't wanted to spend any any food on them, okay? But it's okay, because I'm doing pretty good. I got all the torches lit, okay? Relax, see, look, boom. Got an imprint. Just, just chill out about it. There. Yeah, hold on, I got one more. One more here for you to, for, to, to sing with you. All right, what's your name? Little Bardolph. There we go, we did it. Guys, got it to level 10. All right, eight imprints, $90,000 each. That's gonna make me, uh, you know, something around $700,000 a day. Just a friendly heads up, you can get any single element monster 
Tweedle, Potbelly, Bob Mammoth, by breeding the single element with the quad on the island. An example would be to breed Tweedle and Chorister on Earth Island. You are guaranteed to get a Tweedle every time unless you get a rare one during an event. So for, it's just the easiest way to do it, where you never had to worry about making a mistake. How did I not think about that? I was breeding like the one in three, I think. I didn't even think about doing the one in four. Sad to think Matt spent more than $500, but it's for our entertainment. Thank you, Matt. You're welcome, Noah. You're welcome, everybody. I am the one who should be thanking you. Thank you for enjoying this series every Monday. Did you know what happens every Monday? You should, you should figure that out. Okay, so there are more mirror islands. They cost hundreds of diamonds and I can't afford any of them. That's okay, we'll go back to the main. Just go to each one of the islands and grab the money and we'll see what kind of money we got after that. Oh yeah, you might also notice guys, absolute mad lad over here got rid of most of the rocks in this place. Oh, I need to do one thing guys. There's one thing I didn't do, okay? I've, I've been saying X amount of money per day, but I don't actually know. So let's go, not not here. On Mirror Plant Island, we can see that each one of these, for some reason this isn't working, I don't know. Each one of these is 192 gold per minute. So how long until they reach max? That is the question. And then we can kind of just do the math on it and come back in that amount of time. I'm talking 90,000 divided by 200 just to round it out 450 minutes divided by 60 that's every eight hours so that means i'm getting like a couple million dollars a day if i sign in enough okay let me check and see how the uh how the thing is doing here that's a really expensive upgrade and do we have any no okay so we won't worry about that someday we'll deal with this when i when i've successfully extracted wealth from my ant brats because i'm gonna go even crazier with those just so you know next on the list is actually light island guys light island uh all these islands have about 27 or 28 total monsters you can put on them um okay so this is the first island that isn't 48 by the look of it uh, or Okay, no, it starts off at 60 something, goes down to 48, and then really drops off after that. So this isn't a super big island. I don't even know what's here, okay? But I've decided... I... Stop it! Stop it, dipsters! I need to go! I don't want to hear you dip! Stop! Matt, sometimes I sing songs to myself. They're just so darn catchy. Me, same. You'll never get them out of your head when you get the wordos. I don't know anything about the wordos. I don't know what they... I kind of know what they sound like. I, I don't really know. I can't really picture it in my head. And honestly, I don't know what the heck they're gonna sing about. I, I just know they sing actual words, which is weird. Wordos, more like weirdos. Whenever rare monsters become available, you can usually buy or breed them. You can breed rare monsters with the normal monsters. So if you were to breed a normal Tweedle and a rare Tweedle, you'll always get a Tweedle. So kind of a good thing to do, just get the rares, like the rare pot belly, for example. I, did I ever get that? I think I did. That means if I ever want a pot belly, I can just take two pot bellies, put them together. It only works with a rare and a not rare. It doesn't work with two not rare. So good to know. Plant, cold, fire, light. So Flores is the real star of the show here, guys. I gotta say one thing, guys. I really enjoy Kana's energy. That like hip thing she's doing, she's great. She seems like she's always having a great time. Well, this is all I can do with this island right now, folks. I don't have the money to do anything else unless I buy more money. Oh, wow, a sale. $10 ain't bad, guys. I, I can spend $10 on this video. I just told you if you're enjoying the video, you can smash the like button. But if that's not up your alley, um, then you can smash the like button because I'm suffering. Maybe you enjoy that. Realistically, guys, I want to get to a point where I don't need to, you know, spend money on things like this. But because I record these videos, you know, in one sitting, it just makes it a lot easier on me to do it this way. And I am still also working on making money, you know, on the side. Cause it'll, it'll only take me a couple of days to save up that much money with my ant brat farm. Okay, so I want light and fire, guys. I think light and fire is the way to go here. I'm gonna click them on opposite sides, obviously. There we go. That's not what I want, is it? No. Light and fire gives us the pluck bill. Oh, I ran out of diamonds, you tell me. Oh, darn it. <laughs> What's $10 among friends, right, guys? It's nothing, here we go. Another 14 Canadian dollars down the drain. It's a platypus with strings tied to its beak. Oh, oh. <laughs> I thought that was it just, you know, you get you get the four notes and then I'm out of here. Oh, okay. It's a nice little accent piece. We'll call it that. Oh, look at that. It's like a hula, but it's a tuba. It's a, it's a Sousa. I don't even. 
Oh, but look at this thing. No, honestly, I, I want the Bulbo and the Spy Trap, guys. I'm gonna go light cold first, okay? And then we'll deal with it. Light, cold, coming together to make a mammoth. Come on, there it is. Boom, the Bulbo. Oh. It's it's just doing a little bit of percussion and its eyes are bulging out. Wow. Now I have to do something I've never done before. I don't even know how this works, but uh, welcome to my humble hotel. <laughs> Anytime I say hotel, I just think about, you know, sweet life is Zach and Cody. What a lovely, what a wonderful hotel or whatever. Yeah, it's a thing I remember Mr. Mosby saying. I love that guy. Hard to believe, but every once in a while, even singing monsters need a break from all that singing. Luckily, this humble little hotel serves up the right kind of atmosphere for monsters to rest and relax. So I want light, cold, and plant. So we just need to add a, add a plant to this mix. We got our light and our cold, which means we can get rid of um, pluck bill over here, Tasmunia. Move, pack it up, or check in. It's a nicer way. <laughs> to say that <laughs> so plectrum pop uh plectrum and rudy that's not it that is a pop belly so i would like to point out guys i do not have any torches here this is a brand new island it doesn't have the things that i want i will put some torches here and then you guys can light my torches here it is guys the spy trap 30 something diamonds later we're opening it up and boom Look at this creepy little thing. All right, now do, do something. Okay. I really, there's something very like disturbing about this spider-like thing banging on its enclosure, begging to be free to do who knows what. Probably bad things because it's a spider. That's a good start there. I wanna go to Plant Island to get myself the epic if I can. Is he on Plant Island? I don't actually know how this works. So let's check the collection. Yes! Oh my gosh. Are you all- Werewolf! All rares and epics from Earth Island are available to buy or breed on their respective islands in the grand finale of Summer Song. Well, there's some interesting folks over here. Ooh-wee. The shrub looking kind of cool with a little pearl on his back. Drumpler will be cool to get. I'm gonna try and get at least the rare mammoth, but I would like to get the epic, obviously. Oh, guys, I also have some more comments that I should read, so here's one. No, the only reason that the Celestials look different than the statues is because they're the baby versions of the Celestials. You can see the full-grown version of the Celestials in the prequel, My Singing Monsters, Dawn of Fire. This comment was left before I made the Dawn of Fire video, but I didn't read the comments for this video because I wanted to read the comments on the last episode of the original My Singing Monsters for this video. But good, good point. I'll check that out at some point. Here I am, over five years later, still watching. Matt basically raised me more than my parents did. Well, there's a reason they call me Papa Eyebrows, okay? Matt, my singing monster should pay me. My singing monsters has already offered to give him diamonds before during the beginning of the series. Also, Matt, the client said offer for the reason that his viewers like seeing him suffer. Don't worry guys, I will eventually be doing something with the My Singing Monsters people, okay? I'll have to reach back out to them and say, I've made a huge mistake, I would now like your help. <laughs> so to breed an epic mammoth, we need uh, Entbrat and Furcorn, but we're gonna have to pay for any Entbrats that we get, huh? So two three element monsters, as long as they both have the cold element, can potentially breed a rare mammoth. Should we try that first? They're both gonna be expensive to do, but I have a few diamonds here, so let's give it a try. So this means we can breed um, the Clamble and the Bogart if we want. So we get a level 10 here, two level 10s, it should be good, right? Oh wait, I didn't like my things yet. Okay, there's a Bogart, can we zap ya? Yeah? All right, five diamonds. There it is, the rare mammoth. So it's not too hard to get a rare, guys. Um, I didn't find it too hard to get the epic either, especially with the torches lit. So thank you for lighting my torches, guys. You really light a fire inside of me. I just realized that you can bigify the, the Wubox. Oh my God. <laughs> That's a little big, guys. A little big, funny. Okay, get out, get out of my way. You're like blocking off my whole thing. Where, where am I gonna put you, man? Jeez, you're, you're just stepping on everything. This is ridiculous. Okay, so if we wanna get the epic mammoth, we need to breed Ferg with, was it Vinny or something? Vinton. Ferg and Vinton, go, that's not the one. Nice try. I don't know how much this will help, guys, but I'm gonna make Vinton a little higher level, perhaps. Get him to, oh, so close to level 10, Vinton, sorry. 
Um, yeah, I, I know that maybe that would, you know, make a little bit of a difference here because uh, I've done like 10 tries now and haven't gotten it. So just keep going. Okay, uh, everybody, before you go down in the comments and roast me for making a huge mistake, I read that wrong. I was using the wrong combination, but it was a great way to test, wasn't it? Great way to make sure, yep, if a four and a one makes a one. <laughs> I am supposed to be combining Entbrat with our old pal, Furcorn. That's what I'm supposed to be doing. So let's do that instead. And we can send the Furcorn pretty much anywhere. So that's nice. And there it is. So, <laughs> I thought it was gonna take me a while. I was like, oh man, it's really uh, taking a while. I got a lot of these pop alleys over here. No, Matt, you just don't know. You don't know things, okay? You don't know things. There it is. Look at how many arms that guy got. Several, and he's a beautiful, Shade of purple as well. That means that I'm definitely getting the werewolf, guys. I don't care, and I'm also getting the epic guy, you know? So, epic drumplers up next. I'm doing it. Hatter, deets, baby time. That's not the baby. Keep going. This might actually end up being more expensive than the uh, the epic mammoth. Wait. Hey, oh, epic drumpler. Oh, yeah. Look at that, man. That's crazy. It's not just a spooktical story keeping little monsters up at night. Epic Drumpler is fantastically real. Drumplers incubated beneath the haunting glow of a full moon undergo a ferocious change. The chosen monsters sprout coarse fur, all hearing ears, and a superb sniffer. This canine's epic feral instincts make it particularly partial to gnawing on the fiberglass bones of the Fossilosaurus. This monster, like all epic monsters, cannot breed. Aw. Sad. Next up, epic shrub. T-Rox and octopus. Let's go. All right, here we go. Try number one. It's a T-Rox. Send it away. Well, I am uh, losing some diamonds here for sure, folks. 15, though. Hey, epic shrub. Okay, 30 diamonds just to get this guy out here. Boom. Look at this thing. What is it? What is your deal? You're wearing socks. You have a pearl on your back and you've got great hair. Who conjures illusions and casts enchantments? Who can summon? The bellow of a boss from the wee gullet of a dipster. The wickedly whimsical, magically mystical, epic shrub. These monsters are imbued with a substantial spell casting capacity ideal for bewitching unwitting beings. The epic shrub must wear woolly socks to prevent its power from leaking through its spindly feet in its sleep. If only it could lie on its back. Oh, I feel bad for Houdini. <laughs> it's called Houdini because it's a magical shrub. Okay, just to demonstrate the awesome power of the mirror, you know, uh, the, what's it called? The, 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 uh, the, the, the Entbrat farm. Let's find out how much they got for me. 10K. 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 9K. Everybody's got $10,000 for me, guys. This is pretty great. It's a great way to get some money. That's a great way to make, make money. I just need to get them more food, but the food's not even that expensive anyway. I'm just not gonna go past level 10 because that gets a little crazy. Anyway, guys, I think I'm gonna end it there. I wasn't actually planning on getting all those epics, but then once I went down that rabbit hole, I kind of couldn't stop. There are more to get, obviously, but those were the three that I wanted the most, so I got those first, and uh, they might be gone for the next video, but they'll come around again, and we'll get more. Don't worry. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you next time. Goodbye.